welcome back to a new video today i will be showing you guys what the kids will be working on for next week they don't have school next week um so we will be starting school a lot earlier in the day and having a lot more time to play and hang out instead of doing school um when they get home from school like we usually usually do so let's just get started and showing you what the kids have to do let's start with monique her book will be father bear comes home and she'll read this in about a day or two she has copy work. She has her numbers. She is going to be working on her first lesson in subtraction. Um, when it comes to Kumon, the first like eight or nine lessons, they have like really fun activities for the kids before they really start going deep into subtraction. So this is the first page and this is the second page. And then this is, she's going to be working on three pages from the Expo the Code book. So this is one, two, three. For reading, <clears throat> she going over her letters. And then this is what she'll be doing for copy work. These, from this one to this one. And then this is what she'll be doing for the week. So... On Monday, I have a doctor's appointment, so we won't be doing any homeschool, so we will be doing homeschool tomorrow, Saturday. So this is Saturday, another Saturday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. So that is copy, that is um, reading for her for the week. For language arts, she is working on lesson 28 when she'll be working on this one right here which is worksheet silent e and two so e slash two and this is the worksheet and that's pretty much it for monique for david his book he started reading today is uncle elephant so he'll continue with that he has copy work his numbers that he goes over and oh this is the simple kumon simple subtraction that both the kids are working on and this is what it covers um, and he's almost done with this, so this is page 19, not page, lesson 19, so this is that one, and this one. And then he has three pages from the Kumon, and he's also going to be done with Kumon this week, so there you go. Um, he's actually going to be done with Kumon, and, um, the Kumon Simple Subtraction, and also Explore the Code next week, so... He is officially done with kindergarten next week. For his reading, here's his ABCs. He'll be doing copy work down here. And this is Saturday, what we'll be doing tomorrow. Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday and Friday. And then I'll have a week, they'll have a week off because I'm going on vacation. So they'll have a week off from homeschool. And that's going to be their spring break. And then when I come back, we'll continue. Um, for language arts, he is in lesson 32 and he's right here. And I think that's it. Yeah, that's it. Oh, I also took out a bunch of the, this binder looks a lot smaller, small. <laughs> A lot small, smaller because I took out all the worksheets that we have done and put them away. Same thing with the um, our reading alpha phonics. But yeah, that is what the kids are going to be working on. David's last week of kindergarten for homeschool is next week. And then in uh, he has a week off. Well, both of them have a week off. And then when I come back, Monique will continue finishing her kindergarten um, year. And David will start his um, review of kindergarten which I already have his stuff here. I'll show you that in another video. But he'll do um, about a month. So I guess like the whole month of May will be like kind of review of everything that he did for um, kindergarten. And for math specifically. Because we're, we always review stuff for language arts. So for math it will be a review of everything that he learned. Everything that he learned. Um, and then around June we'll start our first grade um, curriculum. Maybe. I'll figure it out, but I'll see you guys in the next video. If you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up and I'll see you guys later.